All right, we have episode two, scenario 11, a final confrontation. Presumably the final scenario of After the Storm. At least it's episode two. There's still episode three to go. This goes deeper and deeper. I fear we don't have much more time. Just where in this accursed place are you, Ekiba? All right, proceed further underground is the objective. And if this is indeed the last scenario, does it say so? No, it doesn't say so, but I'm pretty sure it is because it's called a final confrontation. So the trick will be to look around the place, to do some uh, tourism, and most crucially to recall all of my tanky tanky units to do some fighting. This Night Gaunt did a lot last battle. I'll get my Loyal Shide. Uh, ultimately, pretty much everyone. Uh, ah, Kardas, you're still loyal. Might as well have you now. And this bandit. Alright, not worrying too much about gold. Okay, we've got a ghast. Okay, don't want to fight that with Dervin on his own. And we've got a demoness Zephyr. Those folks are nasty, so let's just stick you there so that hopefully you can tank that. Come down here. Is this going to be a dead end? Well, I guess we'll find out. A couple of nice villages, anyway. And uh, Anya can always come back via village. Okay, we'll have these three forest spirits who've been bossing it. I'll even bring my dryad, what the hell. The fugitive, and then these two, these level two outlaws who I mostly didn't bother to recall earlier on. And let's just uh, take on everyone who comes. 34 turns, this. Okay. Uh, any more Zephyrs around? Yeah, there is one. You can't reach. I think you're gonna, you're going to be okay there. You shouldn't just get instantly killed, even by fireball damage. Uh, well, I guess we'll find out. Actually, I'm going to put Durban there, because he might be a more tempting target to attack. And you can actually come back. Alright. In come the forest spirits. So what is down here? It is a dead end. Okay, then in that case, Anya, you can join the front lines.
I'll even bring some of my more successful level 1 units back. Now the rest of this is just an, a long list of really, really silly weak units. Now there is a loyal fighter back here who is dexterous, but still doesn't seem like a good use of resources. So I'm just going to get a bat. And hopefully that should be it. Good tanking there. Cardass is useless. Riridoc does a grand job. Zephyrs. We got a gate. <laughs> and yeah, gets the kill. I'm just going to grab these villages for now. Put the forest spirits out in front because they are tough as nails. Grab some villages. Get a linear in on the action, but not too near. You come here, you stay where you are. You should be invisible so you can go there. And you can fly up north, see what you can see. Ooh, okay, there's some there's gonna be some drones that are gonna come out of there, aren't there? Dang drones. Fantastic. Good work from Riridoc. Ah, drones, no. through here and see what you can see. Okay. Normal drones doing normal droney drone things. There's nothing else back here, so... I don't know why you would... Oh well. 
march up towards these gates. a healer. That's a shame. Oh well, you'll be fine. You guys are just going to keep respawning anyway, so there's nothing that stops me from going and bashing down this door. Alright, level 3 drones, that's what I like to see. Am I going to rush in and try and total them, or am I going to do something? Am I going to wait for them to come to me? Uh, probably ought to wait for them to come to me. No, I don't mind if two of them attack me at once. Okay, so now it's time to try and get a slow with Illinia. Bash this gate down with someone. I I'd like it if it didn't have to be you. You go on a well-earned constitutional break. You can go all the way around. You can slow this guy. <laughs> risky, risky business. Ah oh well, that guy's probably dead even though these folks are slowed. Oh, we shall find out. Okay. 
seems dumb, but who am I to say? Now, of course, I forget that you're not slowed anymore and you will get all of your three hits in. Kill for you, but that's fine. What can we see up here? There's going to be a purple leader, I think. Okay, one of you can reach the village. I'm going to take that off you and get into position. Oh, that's quite a lot of demons. Okay, bring a linear forward. And you go here and heal up the people who've been... Or maybe a little bit further... There. Doesn't look like there's anything down here. Guess we'll find out. And you can get next to a healer, that's good. Keep everyone together. So I fought through, <laughs> what, 10 scenarios this campaign alone to be faced with a bunch of level 1 units? I'm insulted, this is the best that Chaos has got to offer. Alright, that's 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%, 0%,
It's a really stupid place to fight, but... Especially since now no one's fast enough. So there's a black player who's uh, spamming units in my way as well. Again, not with any notable effectiveness. You're dead, and you stay there. You are another outlaw, great. Don't need any more of you, but there you are anyway. Ready for some frontline action, Alinea? You're quite hard to kill there. Well, let's plonk you down. to kill. That was pathetic. All right, now my fire, this fire fairy can't even kill you if you come out in front, so I guess I won't. Again, everyone clustered together in this corridor. My income's still terrible. get you out of the way. Fortunately you can go all the way back to that house. Ah. And we've got another fugitive. for you. Can anyone else get in? You can, but you're not reliable enough. It's 
too many too many invokers here for me to trust putting Anya on the front lines right now. Well, you can reach the front lines and you should get one shot with 40%. Maybe in the first shot. Fantastic, well done. And now my spectres can uh, gorge themselves on the unsuspecting flesh of these fools. Oh, okay. Well, maybe the spectre's dead. Especially if that player attacks him. kill for you. Well, Linear, you're hurt, so you move up to support, you come up here. Everyone else just keep marching. Oh, I could... Oh, you do so little damage, though. Might not even be a smart move. Okay, probably going to lose a spectre this turn, or oh, definitely going to lose this guy. Well, you know what, that only makes my income situation a bit better. I wish these guys wouldn't make R2-D2 sounds. It just makes it harder and harder to kill them. Now you can just about reach this Enforcer drone. And deal a decent amount of damage to it. You can come around here. that guy. No, you can't quite, can you? my other spectre as well. My options are flee or fight. If I flee I'll lose my dryad. If I fight, just need to take this guy out first. No biggie. that guy in the face and then try and backstab him. 
with no success whatsoever. All right, well, then I can at least park you here. You can go with the Morning Star. He can't recruit. Um, he could. He's gonna kill my Night Gaunt. Well, I could. I could put a bat next to him. Maybe he'd be tempted to kill that instead. I'm just gonna grab the village with the bat. I don't think even, even the AI is stupid enough to go for that one. Oh, you... Misses with two attacks. Well, that's pretty unlikely, but I'll take it. Durban is a is a real hero, <laughs> has to be said. What a dude. One hit from my experienced Spectre. Okay, there's the other leader. No biggie. Alright, none of my weak units seem to want to get the kill. Let's give it a linear experience. Um, sorry, I mean Anya. Nothing to say for yourself? Apparently not. So you're fine. You're fine. You're fine. Okay. So not many of these guys actually need healing. Can I lure you out with Outlaws? You're not even fast enough. You guys at the back are not fast either. Fast is not what you are known for. Okay, but my income's looking better now. This is a case of better not meaning totally abysmal. Um, they're recruiting a lot of automata. Yes, the Latin plural of automaton is automata. They're resistant to everything, but they're least resistant to impact, so... Try and get my big impact boys up there. No one's quite fast enough to reach the top village. Still, I can make a line. There's probably going to be a drone or two back there. Some decent damage. Now you guys, you come here, you come here, and the automata shouldn't be able to kill you, but on the plus side they should take a good bit of juicy damage. and emerge where you like. Mm. 
you can go up to the village. Go around here, get ready to join in the fight. Same for you. And you I said I was going to move you fast, but I didn't do it, did I? I was playing silly buggers at the back here. Where did we get all this money from? It's not, it's not infinite. Oh, hey, you a skirmisher? Why can you get? Why can you get around there? Beats me, but uh, I'll take it. You take 16 damage and you're poisoned. Always sounds like a <laughs> car engine giving out or something. Okay, good thing I held off on you attacking. Kaboom. Two health. Sounds like a job for a bat. Nice. Oh, wow. That's good going. Tempting to use you, but you're on really rubbish health. I'm just gonna stick you there, because you're expendable. And you can block recruitment. And I'll stick you here, even though it's a little risky. Well, the worst thing that will happen is you get beaten up. I'm fine with that. <gasps> My bat survived. But yes, the AI is desperate to kill bats, it's true. And not without cause, they are awesome. Okay, you're close to a level. This is going to be a dead end. So let's go and find out. What can I do with you? I can slow you. Oh, okay, it's not far away, but... Ooh, where did you... Big Goliath. Move Alina to the central chamber. Okay. Gotta kill the bad guy boss first. Gonna slow him. have an archer off with Durvin. And Durvin gets distinctly the better of that engagement. Let's 
soften him up with Tanky McTank face here. And Cardas is a champion. I did not think this day would come. We go there. Okay, now proceed relatively cautiously, I guess. What's the status table look like now? Okay, both of the chamber guards are dead, so I think it really is just get into the center for a big, big fight. Okay, we've got an automaton. Gonna allow Anya to tank its attack. Everyone else is pretty much healed, I think. Positive income balance, not that it's going to make any difference at this stage of the campaign. Okay. Get okay, linear in for the slow. Of course she misses and gets hit by the flash cannon. Level for you, and... Now you're a revenant. Anyone here need experience? You do. You can hopefully get the kill. Fantastic, now I've got another, another bandit. You come down here. You go there. You're not fast enough. But you guys are. We've got another Goliath. Let's see if we can tank that out. We can if we can get it to come out. Uh yep. Should work. Oh, you can attack on here if you want. Indeed, this guy. No, that's bad. You go into the forest where you can gain a tiny amount of hit points. Doesn't matter, if you attack something big, you should level. Two places I can recruit from here. Interesting. Can't really see. Well, neither of them's going to be useful with minus six income. But here we are. When Elinia moves into this chamber, I think the big, big final battle is going to emerge. All right. How am I going to kill this dude? Um, get a slow in. The fire damage is really rubbish against these guys. And then again, if I remember correctly, everything is. Yeah, impact's the best. Okay, we got drones. Oh. 
One more level for uh, for Anya. Yeah, let's go for it. And you can get strength too, and that gives you more hit points than vitality would. Okay, we're not in the central chamber yet. Anyone back here need health? Okay, you do. And you do. And you do. See anything? Nah. So that wasn't hugely effective. Drone strike. Is this not the central chamber? Am I not in the central chamber? Maybe we need the central chamber, I guess not. Oh, there we go. Be careful. I'm sure he's in this chamber somewhere. Most likely on that tall platform at the center. We need to get up there somehow. What's that noise? That energy. It's the same. Elenia? What's happening? The dark energy emanates from those spires. It's the same energy that was released in Wesmere when we destroyed the creature within the hive. How should we destroy them? Search the chamber. There must be some mechanism controlling them. Okay, so exploring the central chamber. Don't really want to attack those guys. They've got 500 health and an 80 always hits Noctum attack in both melee and range and they regenerate. So yeah, I'm guessing there is another way. At least I'm hoping so. So, come round. Get a bit of damage in. Oh, you do get the kill. Good. Okay, maybe it's this guy. Maybe this guy, who is the mechanical Goliath, is for some reason the, the secret to life, the universe, and everything. Some nice light spots. Lots of these Goliaths. What do these spires do? What's this? orange light. Doesn't seem to do anything. Alright, I guess some of you go one way, some of you go the other. Nothing I can do to lure you out with these guys, unless I put the bat in range. You can't kill the bat in one hit. And over here, probably the same is true, because you're invisible. If 
continue down this way. Linear, you can go onto the keep just so that you've got better defense. Oh yeah, you would have killed it if you got both of those hits. Ah! More drones. That's what I like to. Ah, that's not what I like to see. Enemy boss sighted. Welcome to your end, heathens. What kind of evil magic is this? Is he fused with one of the spires? What do you expect to achieve by creating a new portal to Inferno with your newfound powers? Your troops are falling one by one under the might of the Northern People's Alliance while you decided to rebel against your leader in this dark land? <laughs> Don't forget that your short-sightedness is the chief cause of your friend's demise, foolish creature. The power I control now is too great, even for her. What if you don't truly control it? You said you cannot speak to Uriah directly. What if her will is your destruction? Insolent girl! You shall all die! You shall all die now! Okay, he's summoning Zephyrs. Lots of Zephyrs. What are we gonna do now? Everyone, stay away from the spires and the portal. I must think of something. Okay, current objective is to survive till the end of turns. Um... Road hexes can't disappear unless adjacent to a spire. Um, the portal grows in size every turn. Units incapable of quite over chasm will die should the ground below them disappear. Alright, so, gotta keep everyone on roads and, and away from spires. And in the meantime, I can just try and kill these units. should have saved before this fight. <laughs> Big boss fight in this game. Especially now that I've lost 19 health and yeah, I'm gonna save. I don't want, really want to replay. I mean the rest of this level is kind of boring to be honest. Um, so yeah. I'd like to keep the Night Gallant out of range of all of these guys but uh, somehow I don't think that's realistic if he's going to play any role in this fight. I'm going to get someone around here, like you. You run away. Okay, you can do a fair amount of damage there. But first... You can get in there. Kaboom. And hopefully now, looks like currently only one of these guys, well, this one's speedy, so these two bottom ones could attack the Night Gaunt. But I'm going to stick an outlaw in the way. Hopefully that fixes the situation a bit. I can start recruiting trash units. I can start recruiting really useless stuff like <laughs> I reckon we've got a ruffian this turn. That's exciting. Alright, is there anything interesting over here? I feel like we should scout it out. Well there's something. I'm not liking the amount of damage a uh, 
exactly near again. Anya is likely to take next turn getting attacked. She'll get attacked by... okay, two. I'm gonna put you there, use you sacrificially. Three of you can get there. Gotta watch out up here too. You, if you can get a kill, you would get to a level. Even if you don't though. That's a decent amount of damage. I should gather together into groups, I guess. We'll plonk you there. Oh yes, and you get a level. That's nice. You go in for the combat attack. You might be in trouble. Shame no one can get around the spires. You come up here and get ready to do some healing. You're tough, so you can go there. You want to come down this way and help heal these guys. Dervan, you go on to the castle. Find out what's over here. Doesn't look like there's anything interesting. But no one can reach. Okay. Yeah, it's hit with everything. These guys are hitting over the odds. If you're going to go down, it might as well be impressively. Yeah, you get. Ah, oh, nuts. That's a lot of random stuff in random positions. Nice music. That bandit can get a little kill. I think over here the, stra the correct strategy is probably to retreat. Durvan has to still survive, I think. Yeah, Linia, Anya, and Durvan all still have to survive. Yeah, so no scope for silly buggers. Durvan, you go into that house and get some healing. You get a kill. What are you? Bell dancer. Oh, you've got an arcane attack. How horrible. 
And up here I'm really in the shit. Will you... Uh, you won't be in range of this one, or this one, or... You'll be in range of... I wonder whether to go in for the snipe. And if so, from which angle? That's not looking good. Well, Hecuba is an absolute beast, as usual. Alinea is still figuring out how to deal with the situation. I'm put you there. No, you're not much likely to get that kill. You're much more likely to, but then you'll get mobbed. Well, all good undeath has to come to an end. Okay, no, you can't reach anything and you can reach these two guys. As can you, you, and you. I hope Alinea's great plan isn't just, we need to destroy the spires! Need to neutralize this. Don't have any appropriate units down here to do it other than this one forest spirit. And I've also got trouble with Zephyrs. We can't even trap you in. Herself. <laughs> ah, pants. Okay. You're not great at defense, but you should go over here and block. You can't get round, you'll probably get killed by fire next turn. You go here. There's no use blocking these guys because they're flipping Zephyrs. You're not even triggered yet. Attacking the Revenant, that's a new one. And the champion, what, what are you doing? This AI is a real dumbass. Well, I guess that demons have 70% defense in mushrooms. This is not very coordinated. Still probably kill my revenant though. And my bandit. Yeah. The more time passes, the more energy fills the place and binds our worlds together. 
I must go and try to destroy that lich by myself. Elenia, no! If you go, he will... I am well aware, but I'm also the only one who can wield this staff and not become corrupted by the power of the ruby. Using it to vanquish this evil, if my own sacrifice is necessary, I will gladly accept my fate. There is nothing left in Edia for me now, and there will certainly be nothing for you all if this fiend succeeds. I... I... You cannot go with me, as someone must survive the ordeal to pass the news on to our allies. You are a very smart girl, and I'm sure you will all be able to escape together with your power. I must go now. Elinia, my lady, good luck. Elinia, don't die up there, please. I can only try. Elinia is now able to fly over chasms. Okay, gotta attack Mal Hecuba with Elinia. She can reach. Oh no, no, she can't quite. And she only has 20% defense over the chasm. Okay, I have to start to uh, do a bit more work to, to wipe out these units, I think. But I can advance down here because I'm in under less of a threat than I used to be. You can only reach one thing, Durban, so you should go and reach it. And you managed to get the kill. Good. Okay, you can't do anything now, so you come down here. Um, you go and attack this guy. Anya, you're so beaten up, I barely want to use you in the fight at all, but I also kind of have to. Well, maybe not. to be able to safely hide behind this lady and heal. At least with my spectre. Oh, you can reach round, that's no fun. I'll put the bat there. You go and sit on a house. Actually, you can sit on any house, can't you? You can sit over here. There's nothing here. I remember to bring you back later on. So I'm gonna have to watch out for this lady. She's nasty, nasty. And there's still a crazy mechanical Goliath up here. And still you're gonna die. You move up between. You go back there. You go here. And now the Goliath should be aggroed. But there's not so many enemies knocking around here anymore. Are you. No, Linia, I want you to come out here. Oh, 
Hmm. This stage doesn't matter hugely if I throw away valuable units. So, Elenia, you come down here. And now only the people with skirmish can reach you. Unless there are some casualties, which there might be. Oh, you can get round and find this guy. Oh, that's annoying. What happens if you go down here? Yeah, now you're out of range. Still worried about Durban. You come up here and help with this fight, I think. Oh, you're gonna die. You've gone too close to the edge. Well, you don't know that, so... still going on. Um, you've done a grand job of not dying against this thing. Can you hold it out one longer? Yes! Awesome. You, I think, probably need to step back. <laughs> I don't know. You might want to bring someone else around here. I think you're going to take one for the team. Here's Sirari. Yeah, because at the moment Illinia can't get through, and that's really annoying. So you also... The most crucial thing here is for Illinia to get through. Everything else is really secondary. Okay, so now I can see what happens when Illinia does in fact attack Malkeshar. Is it going to be the end of the campaign? And just what are you doing now? I'm going to destroy you. Attacking me is futile. How pathetic. Have you not learned anything after your friend's vain sacrifices, Elenia? Have you not learned to give up? Elinia! Why won't you just accept your fate and die? We must do something! If Elinia herself doesn't have the power to destroy that lich, I don't think there's anything we can do about it. Okay, survive until the opportunity to destroy Malhakiba presents itself. Well, that is easier said than done. Having said that, there are a lot fewer units around than there were. Hmm, how best to play this? Um, now, with all these units up here, I don't think we can really survive the onslaught. So... Yeah, well, just aggroed too many of these guys. Who's the leader now? Can anyone recruit troops? Ah, okay. Anya can. It might not be a bad idea. Just pop out and grab a couple of uh, everyone of value, any value has already been killed. So something that's good against drones. 
sprites maybe, or one sprite and one skeleton archer, something like that. The situation, weirdly, is looking better down here. Just need to... Try Durvin. Or are you gonna go? Because you can stand there and not die. So that's good. Try and get some healing. Then you get some healing too. There is an exit down here. Maybe I'm gonna have to run away. Okay, the question up here is whether to go all in with my troops and just try and kill everything. Doubt I'll be successful, but uh Drones. Serious. That wasn't great. Okay, that could have been a very ignominious end for my dryad. Might still be. In fact, I don't think there's any way of saving Radola, who's my most experienced leveled unit. And try and save you. Try and save you. No, you just run towards a healer. Well, oh, the only thing that's going to save me, if anything does, is that they can't. You know, there's there are that you can't reach. Uh, you can't reach. Uh, they can't kill absolutely everything at once. But these two guys might go bye-bye next turn if this portal keeps expanding. Interestingly, there's no guarantee at this point in the in the scenario that I would have any units that can fly other chasms at all. They could have all been killed, at which point whatever I do to kill Malhekiva has to be has to be something new. Alright, this is gonna be a turn that hurts in the north especially. Oh, this is okay. Uh, rip. What a legend. Okay, we got some random units spawning. Rip. Rip. Oh, rip. Okay, gotta say, this is not looking great. Okay, everyone in the north relocate to the south. Can 
least try and kill these guys over here. Oh, you're you've loved, you've put yourself in a position where you can be attacked. That's nice. Need to be careful though, because you're still tanky. However you, however you play it, you're on a road, so you shouldn't die if you do this. You're going to have to be careful, Durban. You could be killed. Stay back over here, not overextend myself, not try and kill everything. You stay there, and hopefully you'll present a more tempting target. You're not that good. So the only people who can attack Durban are actually only this this lady. Could recruit some more stuff for Dania. And I will. You're still alive. want to be able to position you guys so that you can block any nasty sneak attacks, but it's futile because well, maybe not entirely futile Um, what will I get? Stuff that's really distracting. I've only got 20 gold. Foot pads. And a ruffian! Now I've got 19 recall gold, which is sick. Um, where can you pop out now? Not many places. You go and hide. It's the darkness, you're invisible. You should be able to hide. Ah. So if I just go here, I could get droned. But only by one drone, or by this lady. Maybe it's worth it. Nah, not really. But then again, maybe I could save this guy's life. Okay, try it. Oh. It's too late to stop me! They're really desperate to melee attack my toughest melee unit. Just lucky he isn't hit more. Yeah, the Allies units are not playing this smart. Oh, oh nuts. Okay, now my champion's probably gonna die.
Right, the enemies are still coming in. Gold is still coming in. This lady is a threat. That might disappear next turn. Okay, that wasn't healthy for Durban at all. can fly at least, and you can fly too, so you come around here, drones, more drones, you can't reach anything, good, Bandit. If he can get. Oh no, he's not quite there. Again, you run away. You run to this house and you recruit a walking corpse and a couple of ruffians. They can't do zone of control, but they can at least distract people. If you fall into the abyss, Anya, you will die. So don't do that. Bring you back for now. die now. You just stay where you are. can reach this tanky dude. That's a shame. I could block up that passageway or I could block up this passageway to get to Durvan. How tough is Durvan looking? 29. Durvan could be killed if this guy gets lucky. So I'm going to put you there. Okay. And the only person I'm really worried about here is Anya. There's absolutely nothing you can do! Oh, down goes another forest spirit. Oh, this looks like it's the end for my champion. In. Oh. Have you had enough already? No. 
Don't forget that you are here fighting for a greater cause. Mm. Stupid little vermin. Hello. Ah, Ivia, at long last. It's good to see you again. This pitiful creature is hindering me. Could you sweep her away for me? What's this? I cannot be defeated by the likes of you. I am the Lady of Light. Even without my former power, I shall destroy you. Of course not. Take her down! What's she gonna do? Does she have a plan? I'm not sure. It appears she wants to attack the infiltrator creature. Okay, victory condition now is to destroy Iviel. And if Yell is very powerful, I'm not sure I can do that with these units. Let's just save the game. Maybe there's some extra magical stuff that happens when Ilinia hits her. My fairy fire attack, fire attack has got better, that's cool. Okay, well that didn't work. Still got a night gaunt around here. an after maximum level which is lovely you also could come out and attack if you now who's gonna kill what for me Good kill for you. You're not going to do anything more now, really. Or maybe you will come now that you've been aggroed. Damage and blah, yeah. Beastly unit. Anyone who steps there, unless they are flying creatures, will get killed quite potentially. And I need my flying creatures because I need them to do things like attack Ivial. This guy is literally an OG. He has a fugitive, he's been with me since the start, he's had an after maximum level, he's just an absolute beast. 
Um, crucial thing now is that Anya and Durvan don't die. Anya's okay where she is, as long as she doesn't get killed by this Z Zephyr. Are you strong? Yeah, you're strong. Ugh. Ha! Have it. You'll probably fall into the into the abyss next time, but never mind. Ha! Huh. Thug or footpad, doesn't matter, you'll fall into the thing soon enough. Footpads are faster. If he kills the bat, okay. How much am I going to cheese this? Because the night gaunt could pretty much finish the job for me. So you, you, and you can all reach Ivial this turn. you to fight another I guess so
All right, let's go in for the nasty attacks on EVL. That's the point where I'm going to save the game. Well, that couldn't really have done, gone any better. Okay, well, Alinea, if she gets all four hits, could do it, but she's going to get slowed. Hmm, oh, okay. Not good, not good at all. Let's see what happens. Interesting choice of person to attack. Let's choose the best defended and most useless troops. No one else has fallen into the abyss yet. Alright, let's get this kill then. This is your end, Mal Hecuba. Eja is not yours to destroy. Severely injured, Elinia manages to escape from the underground base as the energy destroys Mal Hecuba and his minions. And once again we have Elinia waking up in a random forest. <sighs> Just as she tries to no avail to stand up, Elinia senses the preachers Elinia Elen senses the presence of creatures of some sort amidst the dense night fog. And then Darkness. I cannot bring myself to kill someone so much weaker than I. Are those my words? It would be unfair and cruel. Who are you? The demoness stared directly into her eyes with a deeply unsettling, emotionless expression. Elinia was still unable to stand up and defend herself. As Alyssa bent down to reach her head, Elinia prepared for the inevitable. But instead of dealing the killing blow, Alyssa stroked the elf's hair, the expression on her face unchanged, and continued to speak in a soft tone of voice. I don't want to kill you. You spared my life, just like he did. I'm truly sorry about your friends. She didn't give me a choice. Now, just let me take what I need and die in peace if you need to. Otherwise, don't inconvenience us any more and I will never cause you harm again. Elinia felt the exchange could have taken place at a better time and not during such a terrible display of weakness. Why? Why do you do this? Because it's all I have left, my dear. 
and thank you for getting rid of that bothersome upstart for me. Ilinia? To be continued. So, there we are. Um, at the uh, very end of the campaign, episode two, Fate of the, the uh, of, of the overarching campaign after the storm. Uh, that's an amazing boss fight, even if for most of the time that you're playing it, you've got no idea what you're supposed to be doing. Um, you do have an objective at the end. Um, it would be a tricky one. I don't know whether it would even be possible if you were in the situation where Ilinia was the only unit you had left who could cross the chasm. Um, and there were not a whole lot of survivors from that campaign, but Durban made it, Anya made it, some of my uh, level threes made it, a precious few. I think my Night Gaunt looked like he survived. Then again, uh, that blast at the end probably killed pretty much everyone. I suspect only the uh, the most plot relevant and tankiest would have survived. It's it's kind of cool. I don't think I realised this last time I played it, but. Um, just as the energy from the heart replica that was being carried uh, by the drone queen at the end of episode one killed Malkeshar, we also get the energy from the heart replica that Ivial was carrying being the end of Malhekiba. So that's pretty cool. I actually kind of miss... I, I, there's two things that I think is a shame. One is that I would love to have seen Malhekiba and Malkeshar go face to face and Malkeshar triumph. Narratively, that would have been super satisfying because Malkesh, Mal, Malhekiba is just kind of the whiny, upstart brat counterpart of, uh, of, of Malkeshar, um, who's kind of bound totally to his crazy Iron Lady plans and... Uh, um, just generally kind of feeble despite all the power that he manages to accrue. Um, so that's a shame, and it's a shame to see Malkeshar, Mal, sorry, it's a shame to see Mal Hecuba go in general because he was just such a good recurring villain. Um, so much fun. Overall, After the Storm 2 is kind of a mixed bag. Um, there are some easy scenarios like number four, there are some difficult scenarios. Um, certainly towards the end uh, there are some really difficult scenarios um, certainly Proximus uh, I think it's Proximus no not Proximus um, the one before Proximus when you're fighting all the elves that is horrible um, Proximus isn't easy um, you've got to form a line and defeat your opponents um, and then there was Chaos isn't easy you've got to form a line defeat your opponents um, and then the Shack style Hive adventure at the end is, is kind of fairly straightforward, not too much of a challenge. Um, so in terms of difficulty, it's a real mixed bag. Um, but nevertheless, it's an absolute blast of a campaign to play. And yeah, many, many thanks and much credit to all the people whose names are scrolling past right now, but especially um, Iris Morel, uh, Shikardi Queen or Shadow M, who do a fantastic job with this campaign that's all that can be said and i will leave it there thank you very much for watching this video please like comment and subscribe if you're so inclined and i'll continue with part three relatively soon